this year. Yes, something new about uh, early voting in Belmont. Uh, early voting is allowed for in uh, state elections in that your even number of years. So what's new in Belmont is that this year, unlike the last year and all other elections where we use paper voting lists, this year we are using an electronic voting list to help make the process uh, much more accountable and faster, both for the voter and for me and my staff as we give voter credit for people. Check-in room. Those who voted early last time remember coming in, having to pick up an envelope, write their name and their address, and sign it. Uh, this year, that's not really part of the process. You just go to see one of these folks who happen to be working the shift for the middle of the day mm -hmm. today, and uh, you tell them your last name and your first name, and then they will bring you up on our electronic poll book and say whether you're able to vote or there's some obstructions such as you're an inactive voter or you're required to show ID or you've already voted. <laughs> that would be kind of a problem. <laughs> but <laughs> uh, And uh, then if everything checks out, they check you in and they print you a little label with your name, your address, your precinct, and your barcode on it and uh, ask you to sign that affidavit that says that you understand that you are early voting. Then you exit here and follow the blue arrows where you get your ballot and put, drop it into the box after you vote it, you're done. We opened at 8 and uh, trickling along, but 80 voters is the numbers. Well, I am so glad you did that because I tell you, Hi. Hey, how are you? I'm here to vote. Oh, good. Okay, let me see your envelope, please. Okay. Okay. Make sure I have the right side up. Okay. And you have a two sided ballot. Mm -hmm. Okay. Sounds great. Thank you very much. You're very welcome. Okay, it's licked and now ready to go. What do I do now? Now you drop it into the ballot box. And the sticker. Wow. <laughs> that was easy. <laughs> <laughs>